Hey, you two. I think I'm gonna have to let security know that you're not allowed back in the building. <laughs> Doubtful, but let's hear it. Never let it be said I didn't give someone a chance to dig their own grave. Hey, that's completely out of context. And I love Captain Snuggles. Sure, we didn't get off to a good start, but... He's a great cat. The best. Charlie, flipping off a kitten? Why? Anyway, this is just pathetic. This is really your best attempt at blackmailing us? So what? I like to show people a good time. There's nothing wrong with that. Damn it, I told you to get off the crash, Charlie. Shit like this keeps coming up. I did. And besides, I wasn't doing anything illegal. Whatever. This is still nothing but hot air. You need to step up your game, kid. Ha! <laughs> You're just grasping at straws. This speech was truly a beacon of light for the entire entertainment community. There's no way an original sermon like that is going to convince anyone that I'm a bad guy. Well, with some creative editing. You go public with this flimsy smear piece, I'm gonna tear you apart. Oh, enough, enough! I'm not cut out for this cloak and dagger game, Sympathy. What's the big deal anyway? It's not like they've got anything substantial to use. I might as well give them what they want, so they'll go away. Tell them whatever you want. And I'll be taking that evidence. You didn't have to do all of this. I would have helped if you had just asked. But it's always push and dig and needle, isn't it? I'm not a journalist. I'm just an anchor. I read off a teleprompter and look good doing it. I don't have much to offer you, but here's what I know. Trust me, I'd love to lay down some earth-shattering pronouncement and dazzle you with my investigative skills. But all I've got is flimsy threads at best. The thing is, all this stuff with my stories... Stuff getting changed, making me look like I don't like the human revolution or whatever... It started after I had an... Upgrade made to my VR uplink hardware. The technically legal kind. Look, I like to have a good time at a party, right? But sympathy keeps hammering on me for pounding back too much crash and whatnot. Nothing illegal, but she says it makes me look like shit on camera the next day. So I went to this guy I know, good guy, everyone uses him. He's called Nanya. He does great work. After just one simple back alley brain surgery, bing bang boom. I can use an app to make my VR uplink have the same effect on my brain that the stims do, without all the nasty physical side effects. It could be a coincidence, though. The tech guys didn't find anything wrong with my uplink, and they say the modifications check out. But that Nanya guy does a lot of work for media people around here. So if a bunch of posts are getting changed, maybe that's your weak link. Anyway, that's it. Pretty flimsy, but I'll send you the address and you can go talk to him. If he'll even see you, that is. 
Well, we took far too long to get to it, but I'm quite happy to assist in any way that I can. Just make sure you source me in your article, right? Maybe run a rough draft past me and I'll give you some quotes. I'm certain that'll help signal boost the story all the way to the stratosphere. Give it the old Charlie Nova bump. Maybe we can smooth out all this silliness between us. Anyhow, I really have to get back to work. Let me know how it goes with the murderous hacker thing. My ROM will call your ROM. I film for my friends. You'll get very little of me. Let me know how it goes with the murderous hacker thing. My ROM will call your ROM.